hi and welcome to my impromptu facebook live i thought i would run through the options available and the details for our class in a box and our august classes in person um, obviously i have the photographs which are going up and the details which will be emailed out but it's always nicer to see it um, in person so hi and welcome if you're joining me live I'm guessing most people um, will be joining on catch up as you probably got better things to do on a Sunday evening <laughs> than be hopping and sitting on Facebook waiting for something to happen so welcome and i hope everybody has had a nice weekend it's currently sunday evening just after a quarter to seven here in the uk my name is jenny mccormack and i'm an independent standing up demonstrator so if you are watching live then do say hi so that i know you're here and um, you're welcome just to comment and if you have any questions on the live or afterwards then don't hesitate to comment and I will try and answer those as we go along. So this is our August class and our class in a box and our in-person classes have merged together so you can take the class in a box if you live anywhere in the uk because i can post it out to you and the class in a box is 20 pounds and that includes everything that you will see here uh, when i go through the contents all of those also include um, individual videos one for each of the cards that i'm going to show you so if there's a particular card design you don't like, you don't have to scroll through and find the others. There are individual ones and you have full access to that. There's no limitation to that. And you can go back in as many times as you want and you can watch it when it suits you. If you join our in-person classes, then we'll go through as many of the cards as we can get through in the two hour session that we have and that is at two locations but you will also get exactly the same contents of the box obviously you will have light refreshments available but you also get access to the videos as well so anything that you don't complete during the session live you can go home and complete and also you can go on to do more as the contents of the box are well in excess of what you will need for making the individual cards so let me have a look first of all I just want to show you the cards that we'll be making there will be a slight variation in these and that's because the stamp set and the dies that I will be using although you don't need them to finish the cards you will have some of the dies included and these can be found on page 11 of our annual catalogue because one set of the papers that is included are these ones here called Beauty of Friendship and the stamp set I've paired is Beauty of Friendship which has these lovely trees which are obviously great for um, Christmas if I dare mention that as well as mail cards so the whole theme of the class is cards that are suitable for men but there's nothing to say that they're not suitable for the ladies of course and there are some nice bold designs that you could utilize you actually get two sets of paper as you will see um, but in your pack will also include some of these die cuts and I appreciate you can't see them I can't show you them because my dies are due tomorrow but I didn't want to delay in um, getting the projects um, set up so there will be some extra elements included and both the Beauty of Friendship stamp set and the bundle will be available to purchase 
at the same time as the class at a discounted price. Okay, so let me show you the cards and then I'll show you all of the contents. So these are in no particular order. We have this one here, which is a, uh, I've done this as a birthday card. The other stamp set I have recommended, but it's not essential, is this one here called Biggest Wish because it has these really nice bold designs. We have a series in capital letters and a series in lowercase. You can mix and match these and they're not um, too fancy or girly in design. So great for mail cards. Okay, so that's a recommendation. It's not essential. If you've got your own birthday sentiments or congratulations sentiments, that's absolutely fine. So this card here features the new cork sheets, which I'll show you shortly. And this has been cut up into pieces and um, also included are these lovely metallic dots. Um, this is the backing of one of the cards. So there's that one there. I promised everybody I would do a version of the To The Moon card. Um, featuring this mercury acetate so you have a sheet of that included but that will be die cut into circles for you and I will show you how to create this background actually using one of the designer papers if you can see that there it's got a bit of sparkle on it as well using a little bit of the wink of Stella this third card is very straightforward in that I've used the designer papers again but you will have the option to add die cuts to this as well. We have this piece here again with a bit of the cork backing and that has been stamped on top. So you could use any stamp to create that effect on top of there. And you also get this metallic sheet as well. This card here has got a folded or pleated design and I've used some of the papers for this. Um, it's, it's best with paper rather than card, but you've got lots of choice of papers to do this. And you can see here where I've got the happy birthday. And then this card here is called a pinwheel tower. So that is the pinwheel element as you look down at it. The nice thing about this is it folds flat to fit in a standard size envelope. Like so. And you have got two A4 pieces. So you could create two of these cards. And I've just used some of the papers. I've added some of the metallics here. But you could have sentiments or messages on here. And the idea is that this would also include some of the dies. So um, that works on its own. Um, let me show you a variation on that. And you can obviously write on one of the panels. Here's a variation using some different papers. So this one says happy, happy birthday. And then you've got a plain panel here for the writing. And that stands up perfectly and folds flat for the envelope so you'll be able to do two of those in fact you should be able to do um, almost two of everything you won't be able to do well you might depends on how you cut your cork so let me show you the contents of your pack so this is the same whether you're joining us in person or um, for your class in the box Hi Tracy, thanks for joining me this evening and hi to anybody else who's joined but not said hi. So you will get eight card bases, you'll have Blackberry Bliss, two of Cherry Cobbler, two of Very Vanilla and two of Crumb Cake. These will all be scored and um, cut for you put these aside you will also get two um, A4 sheets one in navy hi Catherine and one in bumblebee 
and that's for creating um, this pinwheel tower card okay so you have two sheets of those and you'll have a sheet each of basic white and very vanilla and this is because some of the papers have got vanilla on them okay and those are for your inserts or for additional stamping and you will have six envelopes you'll have two in vanilla and four in basic white okay so that you've got some coordinating obviously the vanilla ones you can use with some of the other cards where there isn't any white anyway okay so what else do we get you get these metallic uh, brushed metallic dots so you get three different colors and each one has two different sizes so you get six uh 12 18 altogether you'll get a sheet of this metallic um, mercury acetate and um, some of these will be different colors but they all have one silver side and this one I've designed to use with the space themed card you can grab that one back again this one here so this will actually have circles punched out of it so that you can do a number of these cards okay and i think oh i didn't on the inside of this you could add another strip of this paper um, so this will come die cut but there there are three different colors of backing so you may have a different color in your pack sorry that's really reflecting Hi Carol, Carol, <laughs> Catherine and Tracy. So you will get three six by six sheets of the metallic um, brushed metallic card. I'm trying to show you without it reflecting. So you get um, a sort of brushed gold, a copper and a bronze. And those you can use for backings, um, which I have done in couple of the cases so I've used it on the back here of this cork one and also oh, another one somewhere. oh I've used it as a as a backing here so these will come a six by six if you're cutting it down like this then I recommend that you cut a panel out of it so that you're not wasting the back of that okay you'll get a six by 12 sheet of this fabulous cork paper. Okay, so it's cork pressed onto a backing paper and um, it's really effective. It is real cork. Okay, it's, it's thin, it's not, and it's obviously malleable. Okay, but perfect for the two cards that I've designed. So you might actually be able to if you cut one piece up carefully with the strips you could probably actually get four cards out of that one piece all of these items you can buy the full pack at the same time as you order the class hi Zana right and then on to the last of the designer paper so this all is what you get so I've actually created a bumper pack for August um, so you have six sheets of this paper here which is from the beauty of friendship bundles so I'll show you one side and then the other so this one has the trees as you can see there in lines we have this one here which is what I use for my pinwheel card this one here which I rather like I use for my other pinwheel sample so these could be for women as well as men okay but I designed the style of the cards to be suitable for men but obviously you can use exactly the same layout for women as well this one here this might be one of my favorites you don't have to do anything with that to make it stunning and then this one here which is actually that way around 
So you get six sheets like that. I'll show you the other sides. So we have some watercolour deep green. We have this one here that goes brilliantly with the dyes. We have a winter scene. And this would be absolutely stunning if you did it as our pinwheel card with silver die cut trees as a Christmas, if I may say, as a Christmas card. Um, which is why I've included a Knight of Navy card for you if you wanted to use that colourway. So there's that one. Um, you've got this beautiful one here which is like the sky and actually it's this piece that I used to create the space themed card. Um, another version of the green but with some scribbled trees in and then that lovely wood grain effect. So you get those six sheets plus you get these six sheets of the metallics, the everyday elegance. Not sure I've said that right. Um, and as you can see, these are specialty papers. So these have gold and copper and some silver embossing in them. So let me show you one side and then the other. So we have this one here with the flowers. We have this one here with the white background and the gold embossing. This one here with almost like a cathedral type, architectural type um, design. This one here that's got the copper, the gold and the silver. This one with basic grey, silver and gold. And then um, a very vanilla one with gold and Knight of Navy. So that's on one side. Let me show you the reverse size of that. So we have black um, little dots. We have basic grey and vanilla. Basic grey. And then white with basic grey black basic grey and vanilla and that's what I used for my little um, this design here so this has got little pleats running all the way down it's I think it's quite difficult maybe if I do it at an angle you can see that so this is pleated and you can can have this card sideways on with your sentiments going that way if you wanted to I've chosen to do mine that way round but you could do this design with any almost any of these papers so there's that one there and then this one here and if i just show you the other oh yes we have done the other sides of those oh dear papers only have two sides jenny not three so you get six of those you get six of those you get this beautiful cork sheet great for men's cards three sheets of the metallics a sheet of the mercury acetate and then six envelopes you get four sheets of a4 card these two are thin white and vanilla those two for your um, pinwheel tower cards and then you get eight card bases as well and your metallic whoops and a bit of backing um, your metallic dots there 18 metallic dots so there we are so that is the contents of the box for our class in a box and our in-person classes so our in-person classes are £23, class in a box is £20, I'll just show you the cards here, I think you probably um, 
all seen them by now anyway and then you have options to buy extra papers extra cork you can buy the metallic adhesive back dots um, and also I will put in options for um, this bundle here beauty of friendship which matches perfectly with those papers and also the biggest wish stamp set so those are my recommendations but if you have some existing stamps with sentiments then you can recreate these cards just by substituting your own sentiments you get the die cuts here um, and strips of card for some of the odd sentiments as well and you can interchange the card bases of course so if you wanted this one to be on knight of navy you could swap that out um, very easily so there we go so i hope you like the class i'm very excited about it it was on request to do some male themed cards so the dates for the classes are tuesday the 31st of august which is my in-person class in brackley uh, Saturday the 4th of September so I have rolled it into September and that's because I didn't really want to be doing it on the bank holiday weekend because I know quite a lot of people have things on over the bank holiday weekend and Saturday the 4th of September will also be our live class that you can take part in online if you've either attended a class or bought the class in a box so you effectively your 10 class you get two options for classes plus all of the videos which are yours to um, watch as many times as you like so I hope that's um, useful I've got everything ready for my Facebook live tomorrow morning using a brand new set with a little bit of fun for that one and this can be Christmas or non Christmas um, and obviously any of these you could convert very easily into Christmas cards. If you look at this one, for example, you could have just little strips of Christmas papers um, and pop those alongside. So a lot of these you can um, obviously reuse in lots of different formats. It's just to give you an idea for some layouts and designs of the cards. So thank you so much. I will be emailing everybody out that's on my mailing list um, with the booking details for the class in a box or the in-person classes. I've had some bookings already. Thank you so much. So I look forward to crafting with you in person tomorrow. Um, online, I should say. I have coffee and card in person in the afternoon, tomorrow afternoon. And we'll be carrying on with those fun animals and balloon cards that we made on Thursday and Friday. And then we'll see where the rest of the week takes us. Don't forget it's celebration um, all the way through August and September. So some great joining offers um, for some extra goodies if you join our team in August or September and there's so many benefits of being part of the team most people join for the discount but i have to say that uh, within our team we have a lot of support we have great friendship and um, usually when people join they do stay a fair while and you'd be absolutely welcome to join us if you're not already a demonstrator um, so do watch out for that information message me if you'd like any more information in person be more than happy to help you okay i've gone on enough for a sunday evening half an hour so that's uh, more than enough so i look forward to crafting in the morning i shall be here live at 10 a.m and coffee and card at 2 30 to 3 30 in toaster tomorrow <laughs> thanks everybody take care and I appreciate you joining me this evening, especially when it's impromptu. <laughs> Thank you so much. Good night, everybody. Bye for now.